Virgo, welcome to my channel, Rainbow Wizard. I'll be doing a, a reading for Virgo. And it is for the second uh, week of March. Uh, it is the second of March to be exact. Uh, I hope you're doing great and um, are enjoying the Pisces season. So uh, if this reading resonates with you, Virgo, you know what to do. If you haven't subscribed, well, why don't you do that? And uh, maybe you like the video, leave a comment, appreciate your love and support and taking your time to write comments. And uh, I'm using the Babylonian Tarot deck. It's definitely my favorite deck. It's easier to shuffle as well, amongst others. And uh, yeah, I am nearly ready to do your reading. Today, it took me a long time to get started with readings. I don't know what happened to this day. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I'm doing readings, so that's the most important. Just sometimes I feel the, you know, it's not always about, I can't always plan it, let's say, for, you know, exactly when I will start the readings. It's almost that sometimes spirits need me to uh, take a bit of more time, meditate, get uh, ready. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it seems that uh, I'm downloading more messages in the afternoon instead of the morning. So Virgo, this reading is for you. Let's start. Nine of Pentacles. Oh, it is a nice energy, the Nine of Pentacles. That is also you knowing where your abundance is coming from. Enjoying also your abundance. You could buy yourself something nice or book yourself a luxury holiday. Enjoy a nice bar. It's, uh, it's luxury around you. And for many of you, Virgo, it is your life is going upwards um yeah definitely so virgo someone here um well they feel you are the one they definitely feel you are the one this is uh someone that could have fire sign uh, fire relevance in their chart uh, virgo this person could have leo in their chart it is a moving forward. This person loves spending time with you. Well, if they're not with you now, they're coming forward. Let me tell you, there is a love in the air, Virgo. This person here, though, they doubt, they have doubts uh, about if they have screwed things up and that you and them will never get back together. I do see this person maturing, taking... Um, some accountability and accountability is making them feel very bad very stressed and making them feel that they have lost this connection they might have been too much in and out some immature energy they they have caused some havoc but they're due to maturity and them determine about their wish yeah this is someone wanting to come forward for some of you virgo there could be another person in your life as well there could be competition for you um yeah you have a commitment coming towards you a spiritual connection coming towards you quick action that someone takes after they conquer a moment of perhaps feeling fair not doing anything deciding that okay enough's enough someone here is deciding enough's enough of grieving i don't see grieving as in grieving uh, something they've lost recently i see someone they have fear and anxiety they're in their head stuck in their head just creating a fear uh fears basically <laughs> that could be immaturity they are making up stories in their head uh that isn't really they don't have to really um do that but they they are doing that this is this could be someone that kind of always expect something to just land in their lap but that's not the case here if they want a new beginning they better come and go and get the new beginning with you virgo and that's the <laughs> this is what this person have to do otherwise someone else is going to go come and get a new beginning with you um yeah but you have a big cup of love in front of you a person have caused havoc you have knights all around you. Perhaps someone is finally growing up in a, in a way where 
they can come forward and you know it makes sense to you when it comes to a love situation you know grow, being grown up and being grown up in love is usually two different things right <laughs> i think people are different in the matters of love especially um yeah, this person, have they have regrets. They feel now how they receive their karma, but they have fear. My goodness. This person is a drama king or a drama queen. They're, they're, they're dramatic. <laughs> they are very, very, very dramatic. Um, they're making a big deal, a big fuss. See, they are thinking about you. They feel that, you know, you and them, you are twin flames. They... You know, you have hurt them or they have hurt you and now they feel sorry for themselves. They, you know, this is this is someone that have caused illusion. See, there is double illusion. Illusion. There's a lot of illusion here. Shadow work, facing fears, fantasies. So fa illusion and fears together is not a good thing. They probably haven't had the best support around them. It's like they've lost touch with reality when it comes to a certain aspect of their life, at least. Definitely could be dealing with a uh, Libra or Leo. Pisces. Ah, this. You're dealing with someone here, they are. They're very negative. <laughs> um. They have an ego and they're negative at the same time. They're hard work, this person. There's a person here that's hard work, uh, Virgo, for sure. Really, really hard work. Yeah, this is someone that is a drama queen or a drama king. I don't know if this, this is the person over here. The love, the new love, or someone's coming in with a new beginning, Virgo. So you have someone here that is uh, very stubborn, but, you know, they have matured. You know, they, they want to give a message of love, but they're just sort of, they want something. They're not able to do the work and there's too much fear, but they're not learning at the pace they need to learn to come into union. They're hiding behind an illusion. They're hiding behind, um, there is a good life that this person have, but it's constantly changing. Depends how they look at it, but it's not stable. That's for sure. Virgo. This person isn't stable. They are not, yeah. Uh, but I don't know, it's, I think it's, a, their life could be stable, but they are not stable mentally. Um, yeah, they, they are experiencing a lot of anxiety, uh, loneliness, uh, even though they don't need to be lonely, this person experienced injustice, they could feel like a victim, uh, this person, someone, maybe they, they seem to mature and then there, there is a back, things backfire. It's because they see things as an illusion. There's something to do with the mental distortion here as well with this person. They could be, um, this person could, instead of uh, getting medication, they could self-medicate. Maybe with alcohol, this is something about, maybe they're not medicating with anything. Um, it's just something, there is an illusion. They, are, they have an illusion about their lifestyle being the best possible lifestyle for them. They're, this is someone that is losing. They have lost it. They're in the wrong place. They could feel confident or act confident, but they're not confident at all. So Virgo, someone, someone that if you're dealing with an Aries, they are tiring to deal with. It could be a family member or this could be someone you've had commitment with. A person that's coming towards you could have water elements in their chart. This person could have air elements in their chart. This person coming towards you, Virgo, this person here is going to offer stable love. There is stable love and commitment coming towards you. I see that you potentially have a decision to make, uh, Virgo, between two people. This, These two people could be someone you're already married to or a Taurus. What else for Virgo? What else for Virgo? Um, there is some kind of 
confusion. You could be dealing with, dealing with a Pisces or Aries. This person's coming out of isolation, anxiety. Um, the person that's coming towards you for a commitment, Virgo, is someone with um, that have gone through an experience that is uh, making them kind of awaken to how they should act perhaps releasing fears as well this could be potentially a new person it could be a surprise virgo that you get along it's happened so fast the connection here you're you want to get out of a um it's a situation you feel victorious about this could be a work situation but there is constantly some some difficult uh, there's some turbulence around you a person here that is expressing love around you. For some of you, Virgo, you are leaving a relationship, but this person could be vulnerable. This could be the person that you are with or a situationship that suddenly they shift between two people in a way. They can be this loving person, but they are, most, for most of the time, uh, they, there is a lot of fear and this person isn't um, coming it's too late uh, for the new beginning. There is some. There's two people around you. There's one person that want a new beginning, and but the new beginning will feel very confusing. It's very a lot of confusing energies around here. My goodness, I have not. Uh, I'm confused just looking at it. It's so. It's so confusing. Um. Yeah, in your environment, there's someone here that want you to be indecisive about moving away from them a virgo they want you to be really indecisive and they they are suddenly being very vulnerable they are being so kind and sweet so you could think oh my god i was about to to leave this person forever but maybe i was wrong so then there is another person here that is coming forward to you this person most likely have air in their chart um, the person, they love you. You might have water elements in your chart. There could be something to do with a new beginning. It could be hard work. Um, the person that is in your past or a person here that's very confusing could have Leo and Pisces in their chart. Um, you have experienced maybe a long-term situation or relationship. Virgo, this is being wrapped up. For many of you, you are approaching a new beginning with an air sign, uh, Virgo. For many of you, decide. And the decision could come out of the blue for you. Yourself, even. It's, it's a decision that you take that is out of the blue, even for you. You are giving into a situation saying, okay, yes, let's try. But a Gemini could come in and you say, yeah, of course, this is the person for me. So Virgo, if you're dealing with a Leo, a Leo come in, they tell you they love you. They tell you, you know, they are confronting their fears. They are confronting everything. And they could be just, this person is crazy in different shapes and forms. This person has something very disturbing about them. It's really difficult to understand this person's uh, completely. You understand them more than anyone else. That's why you might have been together with this person for a very long time. But for most of you Virgo that are dealing with someone, this person has something to do with their mental health that only you understand, but it's even too much for you to mix your feelings as well as trying to heal this person. It's something about this person is having a difficult time. They might have experienced consequences, but they are not able to, they, there is an illusion that this person can keep this relationship based on dishing out love and their vulnerability in the way that they do it. It's not going to seal the deal or heal the relationship. Even though you might try to do that, or you could feel very sort of confused or stressed because someone is really trying. Someone will really try to mend things with you, Virgo. And I think you want to mend things with them as well. But it's going to be unbearable. I'm seeing that it's just not possible. It's something about uh, it's not possible to help them and have feelings for them and be a loving partner at the same time. Therefore, it leaves you on a crossroads with them. 
for more, many of you, Virgo, there is a, an ending either with a Leo, Scorpio. It's an ending. It could also be a Leo that's ending something with a Scorpio, but it's an ending nevertheless. This ending to a Leo or Aries could be as well. This could be, um, it puts you uh, forward uh, in a new, on a new journey, uh, Virgo. Many of you could connect with someone. They live on a distance. This person could have um, Gemini and Cancer in their chart. Suddenly, this is someone you haven't spoken to for a while and you are deciding to move forward. This is a soulmate connection. You still have a strong bond. The person at a uh, fire sign is still trying to hold on to you. There is someone in your life or in this person's life as well that is quite twisted and quite strange uh, and it's just too difficult. This person could be a um, fire sign, basically a fire sign uh, refusing to get help or fire sign that cannot be helped in the situation. It's not possible. Someone here is, um, yeah, it's a difficult situation. Um, yeah, it's something that even if there is love, it cannot be sorted just by love, basically. And in the past, Virgo, you have a spiritual connection that was successful, at least verifying it's a spiritual connection. But the chapter closed, but the happiness in this connection was never forgotten. This is coming full circle. And uh, as either you or this person is moving away, it can also be that this person is moving away. If you're dealing with a male coming towards you that have air in their chart, they might be leaving a fire sign behind and they're coming towards you. They will tell you about what happened. They will tell you that you are the love of their life. They will tell you that, gosh, I've been dealing with this fire sign. I can't even imagine. You can't even imagine what I've been going through. I couldn't tell you and so on and so on. So there is a uh, an ending that is happening here to move forward with the other. You are being strategic. You're keeping calm, but you also know who you love. Um, uh, Virgo. There could be this person, the new person or the person you're moving forward with could also have Aries in their chart. Um, they are moving, uh, you know, this is a new beginning. It could be feel a little bit uphill at first um, because someone is going through like a, there is a figuring out what happened in this connection, something a bit confusing that's happened to a person that you're dealing with. Um, uh, Virgo, I see that. Yeah, it's a difficult, it's a complicated, it's a really complicated mental kind of situation um, that's going on around someone. I'm seeing like it's, it's a lot of illusion. It's like, okay, it's like one day everything looks so pretty, the nicest, uh, you can take the nicest family <coughs> photos, everything looks so beautiful, and two people really getting along. But the person in this beautiful family is so confused. They're just trying, they're just on autopilot trying to make it work. But nothing is normal. It's nothing is normal in this. It's unstable. It could look nice on a picture, but it's unstable. It's full of illusion and it's stress. Um, there is kind of a like stressful situation. Someone, maybe Leah's taken on too much, waiting for things to turn. It's, you know, it's not sustainable. It's not going to... To, to stay this way. It's not possible. As for you here, uh, Virgo, you could also be, um, because there is a person you're destined to be or destined at least to meet this person. Both of you, there could be some mirroring going on here as well. It is also not, this could be also uh, two people meeting again, um, like feeling lighthearted meeting after a separation, but it could be a positive experience, uh, a surprising positive experience. It could be one person think that you think they don't have any feelings for you and you they think the same way about you. It's something like that. But it's not the case. The two people, it's not anything personal I'm seeing um, or feeling. It's kind of very confusing, but I'm just seeing that it's not, nothing is as it seems. Nothing is as it seems. Love, uh, this kind of true love, has not changed, have not changed. It's that, now it doesn't matter. The, the reality that seem reality isn't the reality in terms of true emotions. It's just an illusion. It's based on fear and anxiety and just making a conclusion. So 
a fire sign that is coming towards you. That could be fire with earth in their chart. A Leo, Leo, Leo. I see it. Strong Leo. For some of you, it could be a Gemini. Uh, with this King of uh, Swords. So you're wanting to take action here, a Virgo. You're taking action. Someone is taking action towards you. I see that someone that lives on a distance, uh, there is like a, a change. This person is going through the motions here. Uh, for many of you, there could be a divorce or an ending. See, there is like, aha, this is what I need to do. This is what I need to do to become victorious. For some of you, Virgo, you are dealing with a person that is confused. Uh, again, they could be going through a mental issue here. You are, you are going to find out that this person is separating themselves from someone. The mental confusion and stress there has got nothing to do with you. It's got something to do with their life situation. You could help this person understand what's going on uh, and maybe heal as well. Uh, you have big arcana cards. So it's like justice is going to protect you, is in your favor. Some of you could have Libra in your chart. There is a brand new love situation coming towards you. Um, you some of you could be pregnant. If you wish to desire to be pregnant, now could be the time. Someone is realizing their feelings for you. They realize they still have feelings for you. There is possibility here that uh, a fire sign, there is something about a decision. Uh, this fire sign will tell you that they have separated from a, a, a water sign. And they will tell you that the confusion, why they went through, what they went through. Um, I feel still there are two people around you, uh, Virgo. So... Um, it looks like it looks like what was stalling for the longest time and what felt painful and someone might have caused all this but towards there might be gossip I see there is a person you're dealing with that's dealing with a fire sign and this fire sign could be the Aries uh, you're going to hear about it. Someone's going to just lose their shit and come towards you and confess love towards you. There is a new beginning in a marriage uh, as well. Someone is leaving either Scorpio or Leo, or Scorpio or Aries. That's what I'm getting. Yeah. Someone tried to keep a fire sign that's coming towards you potentially with earth in their chart. It's They're, they're going to tell you something here, uh, Virgo. They're definitely going to tell you something. I see you, um, you're not really caring about it. You're just freeing yourself from this situation. Someone is going to come in and confess their feelings. They could have Scorpio in their chart. I feel like the Scorpio is dealing with like an Aries. Um, we have Aries here as well. Aries is quite, um, yeah, an Aries could have left a Scorpio or Libra potentially. Uh, we have also here someone with a child. Someone could reveal that they have a child as well or they're going to give birth to a child. There's a secret about a child coming to light. Secret about a child. Maybe something to do about a hide, 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 hiding something about a child as well is significant in this reading. Delaying a new beginning. Delaying. Uh, I see there is an awakening. What is the... Which connection is a spiritual connection and is meant to be? Someone could have kind of tried to force a spiritual connection, try to force a new home. I feel that a person that you're dealing with, there's a lot of arguments within a home. Like they try to um, put together a home uh, and within the four walls, there was just an illusion. It could have seemed to other people that, okay, someone had a victory, they have a kid, they have a home, they have a... A new beginning and it's great but actually within the four walls someone is still giving elsewhere someone isn't um this could be an aries uh someone isn't happy there there's a lot of confusion within these four walls the mental distortion that someone is going through is really bad they're dealing with someone that is quite mean someone that drinks a lot someone that knows what they're doing and a person here is not able to speak to anyone there is something to do with mental like brainwashing in this connection here someone is trying to brainwash your person or it's something really twisted in here yeah they're trying to catch them in their web trying to keep this person in their web 
by saying they will gossip, they will say that something bad about them. So this person could definitely be either Gemini or Aries. There's just someone that's very mean to them. But see, yeah, psychologically, there is a mean water sign that seems so sweet to the surroundings. They could be again, see, they are devastated because they know that this person do not love them. They do not love them. See, they are, none of them have feelings for each other. It's a false, there's false, um, yeah, false. They don't love each other at all. This person here, they love you, Virgo. This person, they only love you. You are the only person they will settle down with. You are the only person they want to grow and feel that, you know, things are <laughs> on the right track. There is no one else. My goodness. There is a really weird situation. And yeah, it's like your person, this person is sort of trying to keep up as if it's normal. I don't know for what reason. It's almost like a childhood dream came true and they have held on to something that they are saying that this has to happen when I'm at this age. And if, you know, that's what I want. I'd, they're like, they have forced a situation. Your person here have forced a situation that isn't healthy. It isn't good. And they're trying to run away from problems. And they have met someone that's making them their health worse, uh, not looking after them. They're really selfish. They lie. It's like a really twisted situation. You could be a twin flame. This person had moved together with someone. Even they know the year of the dragon could be significant. Of course, it is the year of the dragon as well. The year of the goat could be significant. The year of the snake and the year of the dog could be significant. It's like this person could have left you, Virgo, for someone that is narcissist, twisted. They are like the worst type and the worst kind. But it's something about that no one can actually figure out that this person is that way. They keep it masked and hidden so well that even your person is confused about them. They even have them fooled. It's like they're dealing with someone with this personality disorder that has everyone fooled. They are playing by their emotions and your person is trying to see it's like they know that there is no real feelings they know they have to do all the work they know they don't want to be there but they are still stuck they know they fell out of love with this person a long time ago they know that is ended there could be a child here that's what i'm seeing that's the only thing there's a child there is a child or but it's it's an idea of having a child maybe it is a um distorted idea that someone has planted some seeds in the brain of your person is very weird someone has like really fooled them really fooled them so they believe that they are living in a happy relationship <laughs> yeah like really twisted like twin pigs twisted <laughs> uh so yeah and they, they're gonna they're gonna tell you about this uh, Virgo. They're going to tell you. You're gonna find out. There there is a truth coming out. It's like wide open the truth, uh, and it is not it's, it's like the truth will be exposed. Definitely exposed, and, and in a way that. Whoever has been doing what they've been doing is going to be exposed as well. I mean, I don't see the devil energy here. I just see someone. I mean, this could be someone that is living with someone that have a clear mental uh, illness. And maybe they even, they're not even helping this person by living with them. They, they should get help. Like, it's not good for the person itself. It's weird. So many things remind me of you. I want to feel that way again. I can't stop thinking about you. I wonder if you're happy without me. My life is not as together as it seems. Oh, you, well, yeah, that's quite clear. You're just being near you is intoxicating. I couldn't let you get close to me. I want to tell you how I feel. I replay our conversations over and over. It's like someone is pulling their strings, like, and they've been doing so for a very, very long time. Uh, and they are stuck in, in a web of 
Hmm. Anything else, Paris, for Virgo? Anything else? Knight of Wands. So there's a Knight of Wands. You know, it's like they done something they regret. Uh, they could drink a bit. They could do something. There could be an Aries that does something that they shouldn't do. They, they could also here. This could be an Aries or Capricorn. This is someone that, uh, okay, they build up a home and they're taking someone for a ride. It can be also your person taking someone for a ride. The truth will come up in the open that this person, this Aries, this fire sign, they are living a lie. It is you. It is you that they want to be with. It is you they're trying to like hide something from, but you can see it right through them. Someone's facade is... Uh, like it's coming all down. Someone's illusion, the way they live. It's like really, um, yeah, it's just going to fizzle out. <laughs> it's just, just very weird. Short-lived. Um... They might even have fooled you to say, oh, you know, I'm having such a great time. See? There's an Aries there, father figure. I'm having such a great time. Look at these lovely pictures. But they, so this could be a, a, a an ex that's moved on, right? They moved on and they're saying they're happy or they, they and you're going to find out something that you suspected. Uh, and yeah, th th that's going to be the end of it. There is an ending and this person will come back around to you. I think you already feel this person coming towards you, Virgo. You, it's not going to be a surprise for you that this person is coming towards you. There is happy news here. You're going to, you're going to have confirmation, Virgo, that what you felt intuitively is go, you're going to see it. You're going to see it. Something about a uh, twin flame union as well. There's an opportunity here for the two of you to find uh, your way back together but yeah there is a someone here that have to let go of some ways it looks like when they get out of the situation that's going to free them from themselves even like free them from this lifestyle this kind of loop they are running around like they they don't even want to be there just ended up being there so it's like could be two mentally fragile people and just no good to each other and uh, bringing out the worst of, of each other. And maybe this person used to blame you that you brought the worst out of them, but it's going to be clear that and that's not the case. Hmm. You're going to feel a bit anxious. You're going to feel a bit not sure, but things that things are going to come out in the open. Um, so have just faith in that uh, Virgo. Someone here is coming in to really invest in you. I see a new beginning here. It's uh, it's worth a shot. That's what I'm seeing. This person could have Libra in their chart, or maybe you have Libra. Wow, a lot of messages here. So, uh, Virgo, please like, subscribe, share a comment, share the video, and uh, have a great weekend.